you've probably heard that practice makes perfect. However, when it comes to learning skills, chasing perfection can actually hold you back. What if the best results come when you're not getting it right every time? Often, people get good at the basics and then just keep drilling them. Same drills, same reps, day after day. It feels productive, but really it's just familiar. If you're not making mistakes, you're not learning optimally. That's where the 70% rule comes in, a simple guideline that can radically improve your training. The 70% rule suggests that optimal learning happens when you're succeeding about 7 out of 10 times. It means you're in that sweet spot of learning, not bored, not overwhelmed, but actively figuring things out. This idea, as far as I can tell, was first introduced in this form by Rob Gray in his book, Learning to Optimize Movement, and is backed by research in both human motor learning and machine learning. What does it mean for your practice? If you're succeeding two out of three or three out of four times, you're getting enough success to feel what works and enough mistakes to keep learning. Too easy? Time to level up. Try the next progression. Make it harder. Too hard? Scale it down. Go back a step or do it slower. The idea is to stay in that productive space where each rep teaches you something. So next time you train, don't just aim to get it right. Aim to get better.